Please kindly notice that the UI has been renewed. Similar tools are grouped and after tape feature is added. Select Add Suen Tool from 2D Toolbar. Click on a Suen line and drag to move it. Release your mouse to locate it in the desired place. Click and drag the end of the Suen line to change its length. When you drag the point, there will be the blue point to show the same lens with the other pair. Right click when moving to open moving distance window. You can adjust the distance moved and total length of the sewing line. When you click on the overlapping sewing line points, you can choose either of them. Then you can adjust it. Click at the Suen tool to select the Suen line to be adjusted. After choosing the desired Suen line, you can adjust the properties in Property Editor. First, you can change the Suen line type to Turned. After activating simulation, double-layered patterns are sewn together crisp and flat. When the Suen type is changed back to Custom Angle, the pattern will be plumped again. Fold strength and fold angle are activated only when the Suen line type is custom angle. The Suen line is folded towards the front of the pattern as the fold angle is closer to zero, and it is folded into the back of the pattern as the angle is closer to 360. The intensity of the fold is able to be set by adjusting the value of fold strength. The higher the value, the closer the fold is to the set angle. You can adjust the intensity and thickness of 3D seam lines to render a realistic garment. You can adjust the intensity of the normal map applied to the seam line. When you lower the value, the seam line will be faded. You can adjust the thickness of the normal map applied to the seam line. If it's lower, the seam line will be faded too. After using Add Sewing Tool to select a sewing line, you can right click on it to visit the pop up menu. You can select all sewing lines that have the same fold strength or fold angle with the selected lines. After choosing this function, you can see other sewing lines are selected. By choosing reverse sewing, the directional notches of the selected one will be reversed. Use this function to reverse the twisted sewing lines. Also, you can delete the wrong sewing lines. If you choose Merge, the patterns will be merged to a single pattern. If two patterns are symmetric, they will be merged as a half symmetric pattern. You can easily add point to pattern outline on start or end point of a sewer line. Then you can use Edit Pattern Tool to adjust the point.
You can easily add seam line top stitch along the sewing line. Use the activate sew and select it to deactivate sewing lines when simulating. After choosing this function, the sewing line will be transparent to show it's deactivated. If you want to activate it, please choose the corresponding option. If there are too many overlapped sewing lines or points, you can hide them. Right-click on any visible sewing line, then the hidden ones will be visible again.